All right, so what is up guys? I am pumped. I hope you are pumped and are ready for a great video. I'm feeling good tonight, two days until my birthday. Beautiful weather. We're in my hometown of Indian Harbor Beach, Florida, right around the corner from uh, Mathers Bridge. Absolutely beautiful night. Couldn't be better circumstances. I am super pumped, and this is what we got going on. So we just have a little rod here set up straight to a hook on it, as you can see right there, and we're fishing with some live bait. We also have dead shrimp. And then we have uh, these live Mahara right here. Let me grab one real quick. We got these live Mahara right here. About dime size, they're perfect. And what these live Mahara like to do when you hook them is they like to sit on the bottom. So we're hooking them right between the, the dorsal fin and the tail right on the top of the back right there. And we're just letting them do their thing and hopefully they'll get smacked. And yeah. So as far as that goes, um, if you've been paying attention to the Ginu Rebuild series, actually for this part, I'm waiting on parts to come into the Ginu of Titusville manufacturer. And because of the whole COVID-19, it's gonna take a couple weeks, they said, for their suppliers to get them stuff back to them so they have it in stock. So that video will be a couple weeks, but it is coming and it is on the way. I just wanna give you guys an update so you don't just think I'm like forgetting about it, cause I'm not, I'm pumped about that too. And yeah, let's have a great night. Oh yeah, guys, we got our first hookup of the night oh, what here. What you got? What you got? I don't know, I don't know. Can't let it get on the other Oh yeah, I made a snooky. Oh yeah, baby, nice sir. You know what? I might just hop in for him. Oh, we're going in. Oh yeah, baby. Yoo! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yoo-hoo, yeah, Let's buddy. Let's go. Let's go. The little snook, man. Nice little snook. Yeah, baby. Nice little snook. Yes, sir. Ooh. Oh, yeah. yeah. Baby. Off the Mahara. Yes, sir. Alrighty, so what is up, guys? That was an awesome snook. Great way to start the night. Thanks to my good buddy Jacob in the back here. We actually went fishing a few days ago. Didn't get enough footage to make a video, but the water was ridiculously clear. And we just wanted to show you guys what that looked like. But yeah, so we're, we got a clip. You guys will go look at that. We're going to stay here and keep fishing. We'll see you guys in a minute. Finally. I had the best of luck today. We pulled up on this little spot here. Saw some little snappers. Figured we'd give it a try. Finally got one. One in the boat, baby. One in the boat. They're literally sitting right down there. Some beautiful water. Kind of mud Close on there. go. If you know Bavard County, you know this does not happen. No, this That's is what, not. <laughs> you know that for sure. No, this is probably six, almost seven feet of water. That's what I'm saying. It's it's crystal. Getting the fish to eat today, it's been a struggle, but sometimes you gotta resort to these little guys. That's what I'm saying, we've been seeing some, we just haven't been getting them to really Dude, eat. that was crazy clear, wasn't it? It's about eight feet of visibility. That's what I'm saying, that does yeah. not happen in the river. No. Does not happen uh, in the river. Here, we're hooked up again. No way, you got a tarpon. Is it a tarpon or a red? Or another okay. snook. Dude, don't let him break you off. Come over here. Oh. Two baits and two fish, baby, let's go. That one did break us off though, but that's the great thing about fishing. We can put another hook on, we got another bait. We're gonna get it back in the water. We're gonna get us another one. What we got, what you got? Third hook up of the night, son. Ooh. What do we got? Uh-oh, I don't think that's a targeted species. Oh, man. You win some, you lose some. Yeah, bro, what the heck is that? That's not cool, that. man. Not so Alrighty, guys, so check this out. Let's go out Oh, trout. There's some, there's some way over 20 down there, too. Eat it. 
Oh, no, Alright guys, so we hook them right through the back right there like I was saying. And now this is what you want to do. You want to come up here and be real quiet. And then just lay them up in there. And then you want to leave your bale open. And let it kind of go free, but keep your finger on it so you can feel anything that happens. And let's just give him a minute and hopefully he gets popped real quick here. We'll see. We'll see. Definitely moving good right now. Come on. Oh, my, something's on him. Something's on him. Come on. Man. Something's right there. I know something wants to. Ooh. Oh. But uh, this light will put off a lot of warmth, actually. Uh, a lot of heat. I mean, they won't put off much, but if you fish, I'll stay around it. Exactly. And it, a lot of times these lights, like Mathers, is good for shrimping. So a lot of times what these lights will do is the shrimp are drawn up by the lights, and then it makes them easy predators for the, the fish, too. Yeah, they, underneath them. it's easy for him to see. Alrighty guys, so that is going to do it for tonight. We did not catch all the fish in the world, but hey, we had a great time. We're out here, it's a beautiful night. I could not ask for more. I got a good snook. Jacob got a few fish. He got some good hits, some good knockdowns, but we were not able to land any of his. But hey, had a great time. Beautiful night. Can't ask for much more than that. That'll do it. And if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. I'm going to try and bring more content to you guys more consistently. And yeah, I appreciate all of your guys' views and love and support. It really means a lot to me. And it, it, the more love and support I can get, the more it allows me to be able to do. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed.